पितरृष्णवर्णाश्च चतुस्ता यूत्रकूत्रकाभयाढ़्यास्ताम्यहम नमस्कार दिस इज विवेक भव वेलकम टू ऑल रिलीजियस ब्रदर्स एंड सिस्टर्स नमस्कार At present, ancestors period is going on. Today, we should discuss something about our ancestors and how we can offer them our gratitudes every year. after ganesh festival and before navaratri these 15 days known for ancestors you know who are ancestors and what is our responsibility to soothe them our father grandfather great grandfather mother same thing uncle maternal uncle aunt our friends who has passed away but they have done so much for us so for all of them not only human beings but even your pets you have dog you have cow horse any pet and when they passes away they go to your ancestors list not only animals but trees shrubs herbs who has given us a lot for them we offer our gratitudes during these 15 days our saints and our sages has given us beautiful opportunity to offer our gratitudes during this time we should offer food to great brahmins who recites all these vedic chants we should donate clothes dakshina money and etc we should offer them and through this way we send our love to our four fathers you know during this time what you will give it will reach to them there is a ancestor loka is a certain state of ancestors and when they will bless you there will children in your home 
you will have grandchildren you will have prosperity all kind of anxieties will go away because of their blessings during this time we offer food to cows also we give food to the crows because they come to our home and they ask do you remember your ancestors or not in all over india people they will give food money gold silver so many things what they want they give but at least that is our responsibility to offer food to offer clothing to our ancestors there are certain dates when your forefathers has been gone but there are particular dates during this 15 days new moon is very auspicious day 12th day next day to ekadashi is also very auspicious day one day before ekadashi is also very auspicious day we should offer food these days now we will have so many questions how can we offer this puja because we are living long long away from from india from this ganges river from pilgrimage places we are not very close but i suggest you you have photographs of your ancestors you can send it to your priest you can send your dakshina to them and tell them please do shraddha puja the name of this puja is shraddha puja mahalaya shraddha puja in this puja not only for old people but sometime small children they possess all so for them also we offer our gratitude somehow you forgotten every month new moon day is for ancestors but i am reminding you that this is the good time to offer all your gratitudes brothers and sisters all pious people i suggest you do puja for ancestors and be peaceful for whole year because because of them you will achieve all of your goals 
and everything will happen in your life peacefully. So do this. Thank you very much.